sad age when many live theatres are being replaced by gargantuan blocks of offices, it's refreshingly pleasant to hear of new ones being built. But one of the most remarkable construction jobs undertaken in this country has been a Roman-style open-air playhouse seating 2,000 people, built entirely by schoolboys. The location is the Chelmsford Avenue Secondary Modern School at Grimsby, where, under the direction of English and drama master Colin Laycock and the head, Mr Kingsland, the boys have spent nearly five years creating a magnificent theatre from thousands of tons of brick and concrete. With picks, shovels and other equipment borrowed from home, lads like these worked day after day and gave up evenings and even holidays to finish the project. The quotation from the Bible at the theatre's entrance symbolises the spirit of the venture. For, as Mr. Laycock says, there is as much dignity in working with one's hands as there is in study. And boys who may not be brilliant in the classroom have certainly proved themselves creators of a masterpiece in its own right. Even the lily pond and fountain was built by them. Although we've put so much emphasis on the physical aspects of the construction, the theatre was, of course, very carefully planned beforehand. For example, there's no chance of the sunken stage ever being flooded because of an extensive drainage system that's been installed. Furthermore, the acoustics are so good that a handful of bird seed dropped on stone steps at the back of the stage can be heard 50 yards away. This, by the way, is part of a rehearsal of Julius Caesar. Needless to say, after the massive task of building their own theatre, making their own costumes and armour was kid stuff. Although on second thoughts, that phrase seems a bit dated now.